Hi, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome back to the MGM Grand Garden Arena here in Las Vegas, site of the 2016 Pac-12 Men's Basketball Tournament. Now, right behind me, training is Utah and USC, the third out of four games today. But we're just going to quickly wrap up Colorado's dramatic 82-78 loss to the Arizona Wildcats. This game was probably one of nightmarish scenarios, really, for the Buffaloes, starting off extraordinarily cold, getting into a 17-point hole at halftime. Arizona held a 37-20 lead, but the Buffaloes came back blue string hot 58 points in the second half to pretty much give this the most interesting end you could possibly find and an end befitting this Colorado team going out with a fight going out with toughness head coach Tad Boyle talked about this type of fight that they had the transition in the last year of this team going from one devoid of leadership to one that all of a sudden had incredibly strong ones led by Josh Scott led by Xavier Talton uh, Eli Stalls or the rest of that senior class that was able to be there and able to stop the bleeding, able to get players to buy into what was happening with this team and get them to almost mount one of the biggest comebacks in Pac-12 tournament history. Now, that's going to be it for the Buffaloes here in Las Vegas, but Selection Sunday is only a few days away, and only time will tell if the Buffaloes are going to be dancing in March. It looks like it's pretty sure thing, pretty positive right now. Right now, they're projected as an eight seed, but you can't discount some of the craziness that does go on on Selection Sunday. Sunday. So that will do it for Colorado here in Vegas. 21 points for George King on 7 of 12 shooting tonight. He was probably one of the best players on the floor, if not the best player on the floor. Probably going to be an all-tournament team. And Josh Scott doing what he does best, getting double-doubles. 16 points and 13 rebounds unfortunately just wasn't enough to stop Arizona and that incredible first half that they did have. Our coverage will continue throughout the rest of this week, so make sure you stick with us at CUIndependent.com. And of course on YouTube at Boulder News Team. For uh, News Team Boulder, I'm Andrew Hobner, and that will do it here in the MGM Grand Garden Arena for tonight. Colorado falls to Arizona, 82-78.